Hello everyone, it's Paul with Diamond Express doing a work in progress, working on home. And we're just gonna do this for a little while, talk to you guys, tell you about what's coming up, maybe hand out a code, a sale code, and finish up this one area that we didn't finish during our live with giveaways. So that, that's the first thing we'll do is we'll We'll finish that up and uh, we'll go from there, see what happens. We're looking for a certain color, number eight, which is 452, which is a very, very light pink. I think I've already marked this thing. Uh, let's find out if we have or have not. It doesn't look like I have. Oh, there it is. We got some cool music in the background. Maybe it's not too loud, hopefully. And uh, crank this stuff out. Went sailing this morning. A friend of mine has a boat. And I guess this is, I should say, shit, no, it's a sailboat. And uh, we went sailing. That was, that was pretty cool. I don't know all the terms uh, by any means, but it's a lot of fun. And we hope not to hit the camera while we're doing this. And we'll just crank out this section right here. So you guys know there's starboard and there's port and there's bow and the stern. Uh, tack is turn into the wind. So there's all sorts of all sorts of cool terms. Then there's the the markers, the channel markers and and uh, you got to know about those and who has the right of way and which direction the wind is coming in. And it's all kind of cool, actually, and it's pretty, re pretty relaxing. Um, so it's a good day. It's a good day. This is going to be a whip and chat. This is being filmed on my brand new iPhone 13. Um, so that's kind of cool too. All right, what is coming up with Diamond Express? We will have more lives. My daughter is doing more lives on her TikTok account. We are going to be having more giveaways. Uh, we've got a few more new designs coming in. And... We'll give you guys a code here later on in this video to maybe get you to buy some or, or whatnot. But watch watch the video, like, comment, definitely subscribe. Please, please subscribe and uh, like and leave a comment and share if you want and whatnot. Get your diamond painting out. Listen to the music and listen to the calming tunes and the nice soothing voice as you do your diamond paintings. No, I'm just kidding. You know what I, you know what I mean. Uh, let's see what symbol are we going to do next. Let's do R which is 938 and I have no idea what color it is. So maybe it's a new color. And I'll just go through these diamonds real quick and try and find color 938. Right, which should be like a light brownish. I thought that would be it. We got a 938. And a 939, which is interesting. I don't know if I've ever had two colors that close to each other. 958. Okay, now, now I'm getting frustrated. <laughs> I thought I could do it that way. But apparently I can't. Don't tell me I don't have a color 
Oh, there it is, right there. I've already marked the symbols. There we go. So we'll put this on there. We'll put the R's on there and keep moving. We'll finish up this section and maybe do more depending on how fast we do or how fast we go. I think it'd be a better way of saying that. I don't even know if that was proper English. Okay, here comes the R's. Place these in. This gives the uh, the diamond painting a little bit of context here. Well, what in the heck happened there? Next door neighbor's dog is barking. Yeah, this is not context, but a little bit of texture to the diamond painting. When you throw in these odd colors like this, I know there's another R out here somewhere. Is there? Or is that it? That's it. That was it. Okay. That was easy. Let's see if we can find the Q. There's the Q right there. Let's fill in the Q. Yeah, so once sailing, uh, learn some nautical terms and back to diamond painting and doing a lot of YouTube's, YouTube shorts. Uh, working on some stuff on the design of the website. There are some things in the work, works. Uh, we did a lot of giveaways and there's, just, there's really just a lot going on. We've got another interview coming up on Thursday with Kat. And that's going to be really cool, I believe. Uh, she's pretty excited about it. I'm pretty excited about it. And uh, that'll, be, that'll be fun for everyone. She's done a lot of diamond paintings. Not necessarily, not necessarily Diamond Express diamond paintings. Uh, we talked for just, just a couple minutes the other day. We didn't want to talk too much because then it just makes the, uh, it makes the real interview really really strange if you've already talked through it and then you go and ask the same questions that you've already asked so it was really just setting up the technology and making sure the technology was working and uh like i said she's she's pretty excited i am too and that'll be fun she also has a youtube channel so this is this is good for her maybe she'll get a lot of subscribers with you guys uh, that would be that would be kind of neat and good for good for her good for me good for everybody good for you guys too uh, so we'll see how this goes as you know we did we did another interview with Jerry already and that worked out really well uh, thank you very much Jerry So there's, there's a lot of things in the works. We don't do Facebook ads here, and we probably need to get back into doing them. They do work. They keep our store in your consciousness, or, you know, forefront. Um, but you got to run them. You got to manage them. And... Next thing you know, you're working full time at this job again, and I don't want to do that. Uh, I've already done that in the past, and it wasn't really what I was looking for in diamond painting, or running a store in diamond painting. Uh, we want to have customers, don't get me wrong, and we want to have a lot of customers, but we also don't want it to be all consuming. I think this is that symbol, and there's just one of them. So we'll try and do one diamond. Oh, there we go, two. Okay. That one goes right there. What else do we got?
accidentally hit a button. That was not cool. Okay. This song is Sleeping Whales. I really love this design. And you can see how wonderful this, uh, this canvas is. It's, I mean, it's just, it's nice. It's flat, it's nice. It's uh, really cool. And the diamonds are, the diamonds are fitting nicely and sticking well. I'm trying to go slower on this one and be, be more deliberate with the diamonds that I have in the past to see if it makes a difference. I, my gut theory is it won't make much of a difference. Uh, that's just, because I think as you get further away from these things, once you get about three or four feet away from them, you can't, you can't really tell what's going on in the diamond painting. So, is that it? J's, U's, <clears throat> excuse me, J's, U's, and 3's. I know the J's are already open. I just got to find them. Because I've already seen them. There we are. There's the J's. This is color 844. Yeah, so this new iPhone is just amazing. Uh, it really is in the camera. I mean, look at this. We're probably filming in 4K or something right now. I mean, this is, this is just amazing how well the camera works. And that's why we got it was for our YouTubes and for other social media. Nice little pink action there. Like I said, it gives you a little bit of contrast. There's another one. I knew there were three of them, at least. Make sure we get the edge. Okay. And use in S's, and then this section will be done, and then I think we're gonna cut off another section. Cleo continues to go bonkers. Um, other than that, not much else is going on. Oh, here we go. U's already been marked. We've almost got all the colors marked, which is which is kind of cool. Well, we got to pour out a little because we're just doing two of these. I really love this stripe we've got going on here. Because that's what wood does, right? Are these signs? This is the shadow between the slats of wood. Right? Yeah, that's what it is. Okay. That makes sense. S is blue, which is 930. No. Okay. We know this color. We just, we've done this on the last one we did. Yeah, 
This is from the, the same thing as Groovy 939. This is the exact same color. It's the exact, yep, 939. And there we go. So that section is all done. I think what I'm gonna do on this video is I'm gonna expand this down slightly down to the top of this right here. And we will do the E later. I'm just cutting the parchment paper. I am not cutting the diamond painting. You can feel it. You'd know if you were. Okay, people ask, hey, how do you not do that? It's, you'll know. You'll know. I mean, there's a big difference between the parchment paper and the diamond painting. And it's kind of hard to cut into that diamond painting. You gotta, you've got to really bear down. But that's a, that's a fair question we get from time to time. Now, here is the big problem. Oh, there it is. I have lost the safety cap. So let's finish up this, this little bottom, this little bottom section right down here. <clears throat> and then we'll be ready to start working on the E the next time we pull this thing out on the live. And we'll get into those very, very, very pretty greens. Okay. You guys can see what I'm talking about, right? I don't know if I, did I bite off more than I can chew here with this section for this whipping chat? Uh, hey, if you've stayed around this far, this, this, this long, then use COOL30 as your coupon code. COOL30 as your coupon code for 30% off, okay? So if you've watched this long uh, and you're still with me, use COOL30 for a 30% off coupon code uh, at Diamond Express Diamond Paintings, okay? And that should, be, that should be good for everybody. And you can share that code, I don't care. Uh, it won't last forever though. The code will not last forever, so Please hurry. It's really nice because we have we have on our lives we have four or five other YouTube channel hosters uh, that come to the lives, and we always call them out and ask them to introduce themselves and root for them as well. So I just think it's I just think it's good for everybody. The more videos we see, the bigger the community gets, uh, et cetera, et cetera. We're, we're never going to be the biggest store. I can tell you that right now. Would I love to be? Yeah, but then you got to start hiring people. and It'll look a lot like work uh, when that happens. And right now, it's just kind of fun having a, a dedicated community that'll grow. I mean, it'll certainly grow as long as we do everything properly. It'll grow, but it'll grow because people want to be with us and stuff like that, not because we've reached out to them through advertisements and whatnot. So we'll have, hopefully have some fiercely loyal customers uh, over time. So I can't tell you how many refunds and new diamond paintings we've sent out and stuff like that. So, okay, let's get this shadow in here. This is the ampersand again. My daughter's actually working on two diamond paintings at one time. I don't know how she does it. Um, I wouldn't be able, she's gonna do, she's probably gonna do three in the time that it takes me to do this one right here. She's a lot faster than I am. That's okay. 
She's actually in another room right now. I asked her to come down and go, hey man, join my join my whip and chat. Do the father-daughter bonding time again. Hey, but I am I am really psyched about these interviews. I just think they're I just think they're they're so cool. Uh, because the the folks that we interview are just so proud of their diamond paintings and how they look and you know think about it we all spend hours on these things and it's a chance to it's a chance to show them off to everybody so if you want to be in an interview on YouTube they're not live I mean they're they're recorded uh, if you'd like to do that and show off all your wonderful diamond paintings, send us an email. The email will be in the notes to this. Uh, send us an email and put interview in the title, please. And then that way we'll find it and we will contact you. And, you know, we want to have a, we want to have enough people on deck and ready to go to do a lot of interviews and we're learning as we go on the channel how to do the interviews what sounds best what lighting works best um, so there is a production aspect to it and of course our guests are our guests are awesome and are always going to be awesome but if you think you'd want to do it uh, I put a challenge to you to make a New Year's resolutions to try bold new things this year. And one of those would be to be interviewed on YouTube and have your face out there for the whole world to see. Actually, we'll be lucky if we get 500 views, right? Uh, and even if it went uh, viral, uh, that would probably be about 3,000 views which sounds terrifying, but at the end of the day, it's really not. You're the same person before and after the interview. How the interview goes will not change that. The same people that are your friends and love you are still gonna be your friends and love you, okay? Uh, so I just put it out there to challenge yourself to consider doing the interview. Consider, that's it. Um, you, you might be surprised. And the first one we did was a lot of fun. And I can already tell the next one's going to be just as much fun. Okay, I think I can sneak these T's in right here. I'm going to try that. I don't like getting too close to the edge. Because then you end up going over the, over the paper. There you go. I'm just going to move that thing off to the side. And put those in there. There we go. My iPhone is on a tripod right now. I have a light off to the side. And I've got a light pad that is rocking out the diamond painting. So it might be time to do another video on the light pad to show you all the things that I've learned about it uh, and how, it, how much it helps maybe do before and after. But I can show you, I can just show you this real quick that when I turn this thing off, look at that. Imagine diamond painting with that as opposed to one, two, three. That's what, we're, that's what we're using right there. That's so much better, isn't it? With that light. I made a mess over here. Hang on a second, folks. You'll hear the diamonds dropping into the tray. So we'll, we'll do that with the light pad. Uh, you got to have one of these light pads. Oops. Are we still doing okay? Okay. I really, I really hit that one hard. But this is, this has made diamond painting so much easier. I need to get out my, my amplification light, my magnifying light, which I just got in the mail. 
which we did a video on that too, but that was, that's going to be a game changer. I need to, I need to try that and get it set up and try it. Maybe I'll do a video on that. Hopefully winter is winding down for you wherever you are and that you may have had a semi-warm spring day already, maybe. You can hope that maybe the worst weather is behind you. Uh, it's probably not all behind you yet. Uh, April and May can still still get cold in a lot of places. But at least, at least maybe the, the super duper bitter cold is behind you. Man, there are a lot of H's. Of course that makes sense. This bag is this bag is pretty heavy with diamonds. I'm doing the two furs and the three furs for this symbol right now. Seeing how fast I can go. So I want to get this section done while we're while we're still talking. I don't want to drone on and on forever, but I think you guys deserve to see this section finished up. It shouldn't be that hard. I can pan out, show you how we're doing. Talk about diamond paintings and cool 30 is the code for 30% off. And if I haven't already said it, which I know I have, please like, comment, and subscribe if you're here. If there's a certain type of video you'd like to see, uh, mention that in the comments as well. Realize that we do framing videos, ceiling videos, tips and techniques on how to fix a, ru a ruined diamond painting video, how to remove loose diamonds, how do you get paper unstuck, how do you iron a diamond painting, we've done one of those, how do you pick up loose diamonds, uh, we've probably done five or six videos on what to do with leftover diamonds, and uh, the answer on that one is do whatever you want, right, they're your diamonds, uh, you don't have to be super creative either. Just think of something that might be cool with them and get some glue and start sticking them somewhere. And uh, you'll, be, you'll be surprised at what happens. And this is our 168th video, I think, something like that. I think that's what somebody, somebody told me. Do we need V's? No. Sevens, sevens and W's. Do we have we even done the W's yet? Let me see. W three zero four seven. Yes, we have. It's marked. Here we go. This one posted today too. This is this is going right up on YouTube as soon as we finish up. So not gonna wait till tomorrow morning. Not gonna not gonna try and time this one. Not gonna send out an email. We're just gonna post it up there and take what we get. And send it out there to all our viewers that have subscribed and rung the bell that want to watch and listen and talk about diamond painting you know I'm starting to like this is amazing there are diamond painters out there that only do singles and I'm starting to see the method to their madness because I'm starting to really like these singles uh, when you just Kind of go slow and take it easy. I can see the allure to just doing singles. Now, granted, I'm not going to change from being a rabid multi-placer to going singles overnight, but I can I can start to feel it now. 
and I kind of I kind of see what the I kind of see what they're what they're feeling like. Uh, there's a sense of calmness and relaxation that comes over when you really do these one by one and you focus. They also look really nice when you put them in one by one and very deliberately. There's no crookedness. Each one fits just like the last one. Uh, so, yeah, leave a comment. Let me know what you think about that. Do you like multi placers? Do you like singles? Or, you know, if you ever have ideas about how to do lives or anything, send us an email. We love to hear from our customers. We love to read about diamond painting, hear about it. Oops, I missed an H right there. We'll have to go back and get that one. So, yeah. Uh, I do not have all the great ideas in the world about diamond painting. Right? Oh, we also do unboxing videos, too. Uh, we mostly do Diamond Express unboxings. But we do do some of other other companies mostly we stay pretty positive when we do those uh, we haven't seen anything seen anything that's really caught our attention we don't want to want to bad mouth anybody that wouldn't be cool and I think we're going to put this one right up there and that opens up the H. So when we come back with the H, we've got two more H's to do. <clears throat> we'll go into the we'll go into the sevens here. I think we just lost our music. We did. We lost our music. It's coming back though. Here it comes. Kind of changed up the music on this presentation. All right, let's do this H while it's sitting right here. And we know we've missed two, right? One up top and one right there. Crank these out. Where is the first one? It was right in there. There you go. And the second one right there. Okay, good. And let's see with a seven. Oh, we do have an eight. Yeah, the coolest news probably is this new art that we're getting. Uh, we've got some new designs coming, and I think I think folks are going to be pretty excited when you see them. Uh, I wish I had a better guess on the time frame. But I'd say, I'd say in the near in the near future. Whatever the heck that means. In the near future, we will be getting new designs, better designs. Okay, and there's an eight over here. And there's an eight down here, right underneath that. Slide it under, there we go. There we go, okay. Now we'll get the sevens and the pound sign. And I think we'll be ready to call it a wrap on this one. Um, kinda like this Noah music to be honest with you. It's uh, chill. You know what I mean? And we're diamond painting. <clears throat> is that a V? That is a V, and we are gonna do that V. We're gonna come back with the V. I know right where it is in my stack of stuff over here. 
move this tray over. I don't even I don't even have to fully shake these things when you do small sections like this. Because you can always find a diamond that's ready to go. Okay. Sevens and a V. And then we will complete this section. I will pan out. I will show everybody what it looks like. And then we'll scan around the diamond painting uh, and take a look at it. We'll work on showing you what's up with this camera too and some of the cool things we can do with the camera. Uh, let's try that at the end of this thing. Okay, seven. Which one is seven? That is 369. It looks like light green. It's right here. Okay. And it is. So it is a little bit of a little bit of a green shading as we're about to go into that color over there. I am gonna line these up because I can get some three placers going. I really like this color, I gotta admit. And we do have some three placers ready right there. Oh, just one. Let some two placers. Get in there. No, oh, that one jumped. Static electricity. That one jumped up and went upside down. Luckily, I saw it. Pure luck. Yeah, let's see what this camera can do, because I think we're in 4K on this, but I think I can really zoom in on some of this. I'll show you some of the features, and uh, not just for this video, but for other videos. It'll be, it'll be pretty, pretty sensational uh, features, especially if we do slow-mos and, and whatnot. Tuesday whipping chats, it appears we just keep on doing that. Okay, get off there. There we go. That's a nice sound, isn't that? Okay, let's put these back in. Let's get the roller out. Always do the roller. Rolling is fun. And you can listen to it, listen to that sound. There is nothing sticking up. That is really rock solid. If there was something out of line, you'd hear it with a roller. That's good. That's really good. Put the trays away and the diamonds. The knife is already away. Uh, the diamonds got a different plastic bag. It's not as loud as the other one. But I do want to show you some things we can do and then we will call it a day. That's what we're working on home. That's looking really, really, really good right now. Okay, folks, that's it for today. And we will uh, 
See you guys later on the lives and other videos. Thank you.